And of course, while snowflakes themselves may not be very heavy, big accumulations, especially of the wet snow like we had this weekend, can really weigh down homeowners with concern. They can. KTAP's Mercedes Hernandez actually spoke with, with local roofers and found out the problems that this latest winter snow could present to residents. We're snowing one day and then it's sunny the next and freezing the next. <laughs> snow today, gone tomorrow is pretty much the norm when powder hits the big country. But according to owner of JR American Roofing, Brandy Rangel, the trouble really comes when the frost melts. Or even if it rains, you're going to have those slow leaks. Rangel anticipates a flurry of calls as this third winter storm will likely uncover leaks in roofs, possibly due to damaged shingles. Whenever they get really, really cold, they end up cracking. Um, they can almost be like a cookie almost if you want to imagine it like that. Also waiting by the phone is Matt Redilla with Fat Matt Roofing, who seconds that the main concern for homeowners are pesky drips that can also be caused by ice damming. When improper insulation leads to ice melting, dripping and getting stuck in gutters, refreezing, then pushing back up into the shingles. So it gets underneath the shingles and starts to keep moving up and it just finds any little crack and so now it just starts leaking. According to Radilla, there's not much that can be done to prevent leaks like this other than getting your roof routinely inspected to find them ahead of time. Every six months, you should really get it looked at, make sure it's sealed, make sure it's ventilation, and make sure the shingles are done correctly. Rangel also recommends checking into your home's insurance policy to make sure the next snow, hail, or windstorm doesn't take a toll on your wallet as well as your roof. It's really good to just kind of taking that time to ask your agent, you know, what kind of policy do I have? In Abilene, with coverage you can count on, Mercedes Hernandez, KTAB News. Thank you, Mercedes. Rangel and Radilla both say most roofing companies offer free consultations. And we appreciate that from them. Yes.